Chef Brian here for Mary Man Herbs and the Good Air Cooking Show. It's a beautiful, beautiful day here in January, and just as we promised, we're bringing you ribs here at Mary Man Herbs. So, we've got the grill. We're outside. We are smoking, grilling, saucing, and making them happy, full of gooder love. So let's take you through it, right? Here we go. Look at that bad boy right there. So, let's walk you through the process. These ribs have been marinating, getting happy for five plus days. So in the store, I took a jar of the brandied peaches. I put my gooder seasoning on top of it. I poured the juice from the brandy, and then I put the peaches on top of there. And we were, wait a minute, hold on. Whoa, 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 stop, 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 stop. We're getting way too excited and way too happy right off the bat because we're talking ribs in January. We gotta first say hi to freezing his rear end off, camera guy. Camera guy, say good morning. This is my slab of ribs. Let's get this going. I want, I, I'm hungry. Let's get this going. We're back to hungry. It's Great. back. 2021 and we're back to hungry. It's back on, and it's staying. On Christmas, yeah, you can't stand this guy. 2021. Little chef. Hey. You're fired yet again on this video. That's the 10th time now. At least. Hey, so here's what we got to do. So we're grilling off our ribs, right? So we've already started the process of marinating, but we need to take one step back for just a moment. This is the, the, what we call the back side of the ribs where, sorry guys, I'm getting some smoke in my eyes. But this is the back side of the ribs. This, this would be the part that makes the whole animal stick together, right? And on the back of here is a membrane. No matter how much heat, how much acid, how much fire, any of those things you put on that, it won't break down. So you can either do it two ways. One, ask the butcher to do it for you. Or two, what you do is just take a good metal fork and scrape it, and then you would peel that off with your fingers, right? So, and when you would pick it up out of the package, the ribs will stay fairly firm and, 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 and mobile. They'll, they'll be solid. But once you remove that membrane, the ribs will get really loose and really limp, okay? So then you know you've got it off of there. So what I did was I put them into the pan, marinated them, lots of gooder seasoning on there, of course. This would be a perfect opportunity for the gooder barbecue grilling or the gooder meat roasting uh, spice or seasoning if you'd like to use that. But I just use straight up gooder because those brandy peaches are really, really nice. So they were marinated, right? So then what I did is I put them into an, uh oh, ho, ho, ho. look at that. Look at that. Is that not like a slab of absolute love? So then what I did was, is I baked them in the oven, covered 300 degrees for about two hours, two, two and a half hours, something like that. Took them out and I let them rest overnight in the juice. All right. So there's there's the next step. So then the next step is they come out. You take the juice in the bottom of the pan, put it into a pot, and if you've got this much juice left, you reduce it by half. All right. Once you get to this point here, then you put your favorite barbecue sauce into it, whatever it is. And I will tell you that I use Sweet Baby Ray's. Cook that down, mix it up real good, and that's the barbecue sauce. And that's where we're at right now, is where we're at with the barbecue sauce. So what do we have? The peach juice, the peach juice, the peach broth, the barbecue sauce. Look at that beautiful congealed, uh, thick, wonderful barbecue sauce. That's all the natural juices in there from that from that, the pork juice. So what we're gonna do is, we're just gonna lightly glaze these. You want more sauce, put more on there. You don't want as much on there, don't put as much on there, right? So what you're gonna do is you're just gonna lightly glaze these. You're gonna add your lid back to it. And then you're gonna let them roast and smoke, okay? 
You don't want to put any wood chips in there, don't put any wood chips in there. You want to put special kind of charcoal in there, put it in there. You want it all do all straight up wood, and whatever you want. You want to do it on a gas grill, whatever you want to do. That's whatever it is. You want them to bake 30 minutes, 30, 35 minutes, till they get nice and hot all the way through. Glaze both sides. I don't like drippy sauce or it goes down your arm. I like everything to stick together. When I eat my ribs, I just like to be able to pull the rib out of there and be able to enjoy that beautifully prepared meat. I do, I did six slabs for Christmas Day for my family and my grill at home wasn't that big so I did in, in increments. What you can do is grill off a slab, wrap it in aluminum foil into a pan, put it into the oven at 250 degrees and hold it It'll stay beautiful. It'll, it'll hold really, really nice. That barbecue sauce is going to glaze on there and caramelize on there. And everything will just come together so beautifully. You will enjoy ribs like you've never had before. So, with that being said, nothing says January baby back ribs from the Glitter Cooking Show here at Merry Man Herbs than right there, baby. Outside on a glorious morning, sun shining. It's brisk, it's cold. It's not as cold as Christmas morning when we did the commercial. True. But it is an awful beautiful day out here. And I think we're just going to give this slab away now that Alan has been so snarky and sarcastic. I think we're just going to give them away to somebody like Grandpa. So, Little chef. <laughs> hey, as always. Cooking with love will bring the gooder out of your food. And always remember, we get to have these fun little things and these little videos because we're free because of our veterans. So always thank the veterans. Thanks so much, guys. Talk to you real soon. Bye now.